Hi, welcome to Harrow to you, and this is Mark Stouffer. I wanted to encourage you, and I want to give you some inspiration and also some encouragement. I worked in the senior care industry for a period of time, and I saw people come in with uh, dementia and looking very unhealthy, looking like they weren't going to last very long. And um, while I was working there, I kept noticing people that looked like they were 10 years younger and vibrant and sharp as attack when they were, you know, borderline dementia, which is a lockdown facility and very depressing and extremely expensive. So when I went to the nurse and I said, what, what are you giving them? What are you doing? I mean, it's, it's crazy. Cause I, you know, you, you just can't believe how, how good they look. And she goes, no, it's not what I'm giving them. It's what I'm not giving them. And she did medication management, found that when they're home alone, they're not eating very well and they're going to three or four different doctors, they're over medicated, that's why they have dementia. And I get them, you know, she, one lady that I just, you know, couldn't believe, looked like 10 years younger and vibrant and sharp as a tack who came in with questionable whether we could take her or not because it's assisted living, not a dementia unit. So uh, she said, I put them on nutrition. When they're home alone, they're not eating well. When they're home, they're, they're not socializing and they're not getting physically out in the community. And then they're over medicated because three or four different doctors are all prescribing the magic pills. So she got her down from 28 meds down to five. And then she was actively involved in the daily activities of the community, you know, going on field trips and things. And um, I think that we should never wait until we're 70, 60, you know, 50, 80, whatever, you know, we should look at that situation right now in our life and build a foundation for resiliency. We have to struggle through life. We always have to be exercising and, and pushing ourselves. And I think that that is the foundation that will help so many people overcome the challenges that we face in our culture today. So with that, I hope this resonates with your heart and your mind and encourage you. I am on a thousand day program, taking things to a whole new level and uh, challenging myself to be extremely effective every day and eating well, socially and physically active every day. And I know that it's gonna make a difference. And I hope that if I can do a thousand days, you can do at least seven days to get a feel for what it's like to get out of the house and be healthy and socialize with people and eat well. All right, have a great day.